the Facebook shop. You are seeing this absolutely everywhere. The brand new idea from Facebook to revolutionize the internet. But is it actually a brand new idea or are they just trying to rejuvenate a dead idea that they already had? Let's talk about it. Before we get started, as you can see, I passed 10,000 subscribers and that's all due to the incredible support from you guys, the comments, the likes, the sh everything, the shares, all of it. And I'm sure you're aware, I now have a new goal, a new aim, and that is to get to 100,000 subscribers and actually get a YouTube plaque because that would be next level. So if you haven't already subscribed, and I think 70-ish percent of you haven't who are watching this, then hit that subscribe button. I bring out new videos every single day about Facebook ads, print on demand, you know, making money online, Amazon FBA, all of that kind of stuff. You're going to absolutely love it. I don't see why you wouldn't. So hit that subscribe button and let's bang on with this video. So what is Facebook shops? Well, let me just quickly say all of this information is based off of tons of research that I've done. Uh, I haven't I haven't been able to access it because it's too new, but I wanted to make you aware of everything kind of important that you need to know. So what is a Facebook shop? Well, at the moment they have Facebook shops. However, the major, the major difference is the Facebook shop they have at the moment, you can upload it with your products, all that kind of stuff. However, when someone goes to buy, they get redirected off of Facebook to the checkout page on your website and they actually buy. The whole idea of the Facebook, this new Facebook shop is an entire native shop in Facebook where you can buy the product, you can do everything through Facebook, you can set up a whole storefront, and the most important part of it is you stay in Facebook, right? That's the idea. So that, that, that's the general idea of what this Facebook shop is, and that's how it also differs from the old one to the new one. So when is it available? Well, apparently it's available now, but I can't seem to get access to it. And I did what they said. I went to, and you can see the screen flow here. I went to my page. I hit the downwards arrow button. I clicked shop and it told me that I could set up my shop. And if it wasn't there, they said go to settings. Now I did try that, but as you can see, I still seem to be stuck with the old shop. So when it's available for you, I, I'm sorry, I can't give you that answer, but apparently in the US it is available now. And uh, why is it just such a good idea? What, why is there so much hype about this? Well, the major reason for that is because there are over a billion people on Facebook. A billion, that is a big number. That is like a lot of zeros, right? A billion people on Facebook. And those billion people could potentially be your customers. And as well as that, there are 60 million businesses on Facebook. And I can guarantee you, what just happened? What just came out of my mouth? I can guarantee you that those 60 million businesses are going to be building their shops and actually start selling through Facebook properly. And, and don't get confused with the Facebook marketplace because this is different. This is not the Facebook marketplace. This is setting up a proper business, a proper shop through Facebook. Can it work for you? Well, I don't see why it can't work for you. I mean, there's no reason why you can't set up your t-shirts, you can't set up your digital products, you can't set up your physical products. There's so many ways it can work for you. And just an example is we can link this to Amazon, right? We can take the sale, we can take everything through Facebook. And then when it comes to Amazon, we can make a removal order. This is a bit technical, but I just wanted to say it, you can make a removal order and Amazon will actually ship the product to the customer. And the whole thing can be done through Facebook. Likewise with print on demand, you can 100% sell t-shirts through Facebook. You can sell drop shipping through Facebook. Oh, it's brilliant. And the best part of all of it is, and I'm going to get to that in a minute. I was about to tell you, but I've decided I'm not going to tell you yet because it's coming. So features, what are some of the standout features of this, you know, idea? Well, the entire process of finding a product and checking out is all integrated into Facebook. This is huge and this is huge for one major reason and I was going to tell you this reason a bit later on but I'm just going to tell you now. When you run a Facebook ad, okay, the the cost of the ad is hugely dependent on what the ad type is. If the ad leads the user out of Facebook to another website, that those ads are gonna cost you a bit more money because you're taking, you're driving traffic away from Facebook. However, if you make an ad and you drive traffic towards Facebook, Facebook are going to like that and they are going to not charge you as much for those ads. And I've tested this a lot and I've seen that when I make an ad and I keep the ad going through Facebook so they don't actually leave, the cost per engagement or the cost per whatever I'm doing is a lot cheaper. 
So by Facebook allowing you to integrate everything through Facebook, the checkout process, the paying, the, the shop, all of it, when you run ads to your Facebook shop, they should in theory be a lot cheaper than running ads to your external shop. So in that sense, that is brilliant. So that's a huge feature. The fact that you can, uh, the fact that your customer can check out and pay directly on Facebook, that's huge. There's also a really cool option for your customer to be able to talk to you because one of the most important things going into a, a storefront is being able to actually talk to someone saying, hey, where can I find this? What size is this? All this kind of stuff. So Facebook have actually uh, integrated WhatsApp, uh, messenger Facebook messenger and Instagram messenger into your shop if you want obviously only if you want it to and your customers can actually message you and you can set up a business whatsapp account if you want but your customers can message you and ask you questions and it's so much quicker than doing like a chat support or anything like that because you get the messages directly to your phone or maybe you have a business phone or whatever and it's just the customers the level of customer service could be absolutely brilliant with this feature and on top of that, Facebook are going to be introducing actually buying products, your products, through these messenger apps. So you'll, you'll actually eventually be able to buy a product directly on the WhatsApp app and directly on the messenger app and directly on the uh, Instagram messenger app. So that's huge as well because I can like send it to a friend and be like, oh, check out this product I bought. And then they can go and buy it directly on the app. So that's really, really cool. Right. So a few benefits. Well, I just named a few features, but there were also benefits. But a few more benefits is stuff like it's free, right? It's, it's free. And by making it free, they are totally disrupting the e-commerce market. Because if you think about it, it's pretty much identical to Shopify. Maybe it's not as uh, intricate and the analytics probably aren't as good, which is fair. And, and the apps that come with Shopify probably aren't as good. But you've seen from the B-roll in this video and, and all of that kind of stuff that it's pretty solid. And the fact that it's completely free when Instagram costs quite a lot. I think, by the way, Instagram are doing like a 30-day or 90-day free trial. So if you do want to do Shopify, not Instagram, did I just say Instagram? Shopify are doing like a 30 or 90-day free trial. So if you want to get started with your Shopify store, now's a good time. That was a side note. Sorry, let's get back on topic. Yes, so Facebook are doing their shop for free. No no cost, uh, no monthly cost. I do believe they are going to be charging some sort of fee off sales, especially if the checkout and is, is done through Facebook, which is understandable. Even Shopify have that, so that's fine. But the the just the fee to, to, to have a shop doesn't cost anything, so that's huge. And I feel like that could actually really affect Shopify's business and I, I'm actually curious at how Shopify are reacting to this this news because it, it does definitely impact them and if you're thinking this impacts Amazon and this impacts all these other places I don't think it kind of touches on Amazon because Amazon's just slightly different it's not the same thing you don't really set up the storefront on Amazon and uh, it's, it's just a it's a different kind of e-commerce platform whereas Shopify and Facebook shop seem to be very very similar another cool thing is they've actually integrated it so you can just straight away import all of your Shopify stuff onto your Facebook shop. So they're making it really, really easy for you guys. And and from what I've seen, I can't physically do it because I can't figure out how, but apparently from what I've seen, the actual setup of this Facebook shop is really, really easy. Literally, you can be four, you can be 84. It's apparently very, very easy. So are there drawbacks? Well, to be honest, I couldn't find any drawbacks except for this one main drawback. And that is, I can't seem to find, did it just get very dark in here? God, I felt like it got very dark in here. I can't seem to find information on it. I can't seem to find that much information for something that is so heavily publicized in the media and the news. I can't find like useful information. I can find all the features and all the benefits and stuff, but I can't figure out, no one's saying how to actually go and do it. There's no tutorial on how to create your shop. and be sure as soon as as soon as I figure it out, I'm going to make a tutorial on how to actually create your store, how to upload the images and the, the, all of that, the products, and how to create the checkout and all of those kind of things. I'm, I'm going to show you that as soon as I can. But that's the major drawback. That yes, they've publicised this massively, but I can't seem to find any 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 pieces of information on actually how to set it up. And the most Facebook are giving are just their features and telling you, oh, go and set it up here, but it doesn't actually work. But like I said, to counter that drawback, Facebook are saying it's very, very easy to set up. So as soon as I figure out where to start setting up, or maybe it's just not available in this country, but as soon as it becomes available, I'm sure it's gonna be very simple to set up, a lot more simple than Shopify, because I've set up 
countless Shopify stores. And I, I'm, if you want me to make a video on how to set up a Shopify store, like a tutorial, let me know in the comments because you know your comments mean everything and I and, and I actually do what you guys say. If you want a specific video, I go and make it. But um, one thing I know is setting up a Shopify store is bloody confusing. My gosh, it can be complicated, especially when you start getting into themes and custom HTML, CSS and all this other jargon, right? It can get really complicated, but this shop, Facebook shop seems very, very simple. Right, now, lastly, just to end this video because I want to I don't want to drag on for too long because I made a poll and everyone says 15 minutes is a prime time and I'm on 11, so, so let's just quickly continue. Not only have they introduced in, uh, Facebook shops, they've introduced Instagram shops and Instagram shops, well, firstly, Instagram also have a billion monthly users. That is a billion. That is a big number, right? A huge number. And what they're going to be doing is as soon as it rolls out properly on Instagram and they said summer 2020, there's going to be a new tab at the bottom of your Instagram. So you know the Instagram, right? And you've got the, the, the tabs at the bottom. There's going to be a new shop tab and you're going to be able to set up a shop just like your Facebook shop. It's all gonna be able to be integrated and just smooth on Instagram. And that is going to be, oh my gosh, that is going to be huge. Oh, that's gonna be massive. Like. That is going to be a game changer in the e-commerce platform. It's just going to be brilliant because people who have huge Instagram accounts will be able to sell directly from the Instagram. They won't have to lead away from Instagram. And even if you don't have huge Instagram, oh, there are a lot of you who actually DM me. And I'm sorry if I haven't got to all your DMs. I know they're there and I need to get to them. I just need three or four hours just to sit and get to them because there are so many right now and I haven't had the time. But a lot of you who actually have Instagram, I've seen you've got quite a lot of followers, 10,000, 20,000, some of you even have 50,000 followers, which is really, really good. And this shop will massively help you make some money from your Instagram account. So that's brilliant. And the last thing before I end this video is they're going to be introducing it within live videos. So you'll be able to tag your product before the live video. So if you're making a live video and I'm telling you about selling this t-shirt, right? I, on the live video at the bottom, so you don't have to actually leave or anything, it will be a pop-up saying you can buy this t-shirt and you can buy it directly there. Like it's just mind blowing that you'll be able to integrate this into live videos as well. So I think it's going to be huge. It's going to disrupt the market and it's definitely nothing like the previous shop. So to answer my original question of, are they actually creating anything new? Well, the last thing was just a placeholder. The, the last shop they had for Facebook was just a placeholder for your website. Now it's a fully native integrated shop into your Facebook and Instagram accounts. So it's brilliant and I think it's really gonna be amazing. So let me know in the comments down below what you think about this. Hopefully you think it's cool. If you don't think it's cool, tell me why. And yeah, thank you so much for watching. I bring out videos Sunday, Tuesday, and Thursday at 5 p.m. BST. So looking forward to seeing you on Tuesday. Thank you very much for watching.